Hey everyone, this is the first suggestion I've gotten to do for a tutorial. This was asked by the Beast, and it says, How do you make it only you and the rest of the screen is black? Basically, it's basically saying, How do you make it to where you could do an emote in the game with the background behind you and with Vegas take out the entire background? There's two ways to do this. One of them works for a solid color. The other one works for basically anything. It's easier to do this with solid color though because it's only one click and you're done. Now, this is called green screening. To do green screen, you're going to need to go to an area in the game that has solid background. And the best place to do this has been in a house on a member server. So, go to a house. It can be yours or friends, it doesn't matter as long as they have grass in the house like this. You're going to go to a place around their house that has just a bunch of empty space like over here is where I have a lot of my empty space now you're gonna stand where you can't see the house and you wanna to try to position your camera to where the sky goes off the camera so you're gonna like tilt it up a little bit and now you're gonna to have to turn off two things you have to turn off your ground decorations and you have to turn off your character shadow this makes it a lot easier and now what you do is you go ahead and you will film your character doing whatever you want to do in this case he decided he wanted to example with the attack emote so you would record yourself doing the attack emote on the green area and now that you've got it recorded open your Vegas you're going to import the clip Alright, so here's a clip of me doing my attack emote on the green area. Simple enough. What you're going to do is you're going to go here to video effects and you're going to go to the chroma keyer. Now since we're dealing with a green background we're going to choose green screen. Now what you'll do is you can drag this clip down a little bit if you choose to. You don't have to and you will see this little eyedropper right here underneath of the color box the eyedropper what I like to do is I like to click in this area right here and drag that way it kinda gets like a selection of everything and it takes out the background and now what you can do is you can go here zoom it in why is it doing that? oh sorry about that gotta turn these on zoom it in and now you can see that my character is actually a little bit darker than he was before. You can go to the event effects and you can mess around with the high and low threshold like this. See a little bit of green in the background, so you want to try to get rid of that. Basically you're going to mess with the high threshold until you get to where you can't see the background but your character is still visible for the most part. And then when you play it back, there you go. You've got your character only, no more background. And that is called, once again, green screen or chroma gear. The other way you can do this is by masking. And to do that, basically what you would do is, let me remove the chroma gear. Basically what you would do is you would go to the event pan and crop and you have to check the mask button. Masking is only used in Vegas Pro. If you have just regular Vegas, you do not have this option. Now this isn't the recommended way because basically what you have to do is you have to take the anchor creation tool and make a perfect outline around your character for this specific clip because you're doing an emote. And you have to do this frame by frame. Basically, you have to make a keyframe for every single frame and outline every single emotion your character does and that is so time consuming which is why just doing a regular green screen is the easiest way to do this so that was requested by the beast I hope this helped you out a lot man so with that said I'll end this now and remember to subscribe for more tutorials see you later